Hey YouTube, it's me, Superior Drift. Today I'm doing a little bit of Gran Turismo 5. Um, I just want to show you guys easy ways to make money. I think the best way is if you log in consecutively for 5 days, you'll get 200% earnings. So what you want to do is you'll want to do the Online A-Spec Challenge. It's actually really easy. Um, you don't need a whole lot of money to win. But it's nice to have good cars. I actually did this one, Special Stage Route 5, in the online A-Spec Challenge number 3 a few times, just to make um, quite a bit of money. It takes about uh, less than 10 minutes and you make almost a million credits. But what I wanted to show you was starting off, if you don't have a lot of money and you just want to get a car into games that you can drive, and start winning money with, my recommendation is to go to the dealership and to buy a Miata. And I actually like the newest one, 25,000. We'll just make one real fast. I already have one in dark silver, but why don't I make a cool looking red one? So I know what you're saying, this car doesn't have a lot of power, it doesn't have a lot of horsepower. And we're already at power points of 387. And the race that we want to get into, I believe the limit is 350. So yeah, it's 400. But there's no tire restriction, so let's do a few things. grab some tires here I'm not even gonna get anything crazy I usually just use racing hard and for such a light car these are pretty perfect so we've already spent 40,000 credits and I guess another upgrade I could take is we'll just do something inexpensive thousand credits boost the horsepower a little bit and we're just under we're at 394 now so let's go ahead and get into that race now I don't use a wheel I actually use the controller and I like to keep the settings the same. I don't really put anything on. Um, as far as assistance goes, keep traction control off. But I like to have the racing lines because sometimes it's hard to see where you're going, especially on a dark map. It's hard to judge like how far something is or how close something is. All right, so traction control off. And let's go ahead and start this race. Now this is five laps and each lap takes a little over a minute or just around one minute. Now I try to race clean and not dirty. But sometimes you'll bump into the AI and that's just how it is because they're not going to let you through. And to keep the speed, you kind of want to just draft on them if you can. 
and try not to try not to smash into the back of their vehicle because it scrubs off a lot of speed. And you also want to try to not drift or spin your tires too much because that will just make you lose a lot of speed during the turn as well. And since this is a light car with, with low horsepower, you'll probably want to just feather the brakes just a little bit. So you don't want to do a whole lot of braking. But of course you need to brake at some points just so you don't smash into a wall or go off the track. And doing the licensing test really help. It'll tell you how to drive the track much faster. So I let the rear come out just a little bit. It wasn't intentional, but that guy broke really hard in front of me. One tip I can offer you is um, if you see the braking lines, you can sometimes brake a little earlier. But you don't want to brake too much after. Uh, I accidentally crashed into him, but it's good thing I didn't spin out. I had to swerve out of the way. The car was so large and I was coming up on him pretty fast. So right there, I just tapped the brake just a little bit to get that angle I needed to make the turn. So we're two cars behind now. Tap right there. All right, we're down to the last guy. Another thing that I noticed when I'm playing this game, if I try too hard to catch up, I start to lose focus on my actual driving in the game, and I'll end up just crashing into things randomly. And it'll actually make me set worse lap times than if I just tried to complete and make good laps. So if you're in a tight race, try not to think of the guy in front of you, just think of making a good lap. And you'll definitely set a better time. Alright, so we're already in first place and we have this lap, which is almost done, half, half the way. And we have one more final lap. Now, since we're already pretty far ahead, I'm just going to screw around and drive kind of aggressively. And it might look kind of sloppy, but I don't really, I don't really mind at this point because I already know I'm going to win. See if I can beat my best lap time.
right, I guess I set another fast lap time. So there you have it. We've completed the 400 PowerPoint challenge in the number four of the online A spec races using only 40,000 credits. And we got a good return 339 credits. <laughs> Excuse me, 339,000 credits. All right, well, thanks for tuning in, and I hope to see you guys again in my next video, which I'm going to try to do pretty soon.